Hello, welcome to Never Unwrapping. This time, another re-release of uh, Craftworks Computer World, this time on yellow vinyl, so I had to get it. Probably my favourite Craftwork album, I think. I think it changes time, so yeah, I think it's probably my favourite one. Most computery, yeah. So, I got this one, as you can see, for 24 not too bad a price from Revo Records, because uh, they want about 30 for it on Amazon. So I bought a few um, bits of almonds. Uh, almonds? Bit, a few albums, and uh, it made the uh, posting packaging, which about £5, not so bad when, when you spread it over a few albums. The year they toured with their Kling Klang studio, all of this, they played in Bristol and I wasn't allowed to go. I was quite young at the time, and Mum said, no, you'll get stabbed. You get attacked, don't come crying to me when you're in hospital and just put all the fears into me. He never let me do many things when I was growing up. And David Harris went and said it was fantastic because he took this entire studio with them as far as I gather for, the, for, that, for this concert. This one's already looking better than some because the uh, Technopop one was just dreadful zoom-ins. Oh, we go, oh no, no, that's okay. Of course, he's no longer with us, unfortunately. I wouldn't have minded having... Um, ah, yes, that's the single. Yep, I got that. That's the single for Pocket Calculator. Pocket Tool. Calculator Tool. Oh, oh I won't bother with that at the moment. Yeah, there's a Japanese version on the other side. <laughs> Which is fantastic. Let's just go a bit wider here. Yeah. yeah, this is definitely better than the other one. That was all for the Technopop one, just zooming in. I wouldn't mind this album in a few different languages. I might have to get the German language one at least. Interpol and Deutsche Bank, FBI and Scotland Yard. Business. Numbers. Money. Education, people, time, travel, communication. That was communication. Oh, yes. And they made quite a bit of their stuff. I thought I can see a Roland um, sequencer there. Oh, their finest era, I think, for me. Oh, these are good. Yeah, much, much better than, uh, as I say, Technopop. It was really disappointing, the book that came with that. It's funny because this looks commonplace now. With Korg, Korg do little uh, keyboards like this. You can get all sorts of little MIDI keyboards there, this sort of size. But back then, I think you only had a Casio VL tone. I'm not sure if it was out in 1980, the VL tone. Or around that time, anyway. Right, let's see how yellow it is. Ah, it's a, um, it's another plastic holder for sweet cigarettes colour. <laughs> it's definitely a childhood um, yellow, that. I can remember, it. actually, funny enough, I can remember getting an Action Man that had a backpack. that had a little tiny record in it uh, played commands and things you know, way before we had samples and what have you and I think it had a record in this sort of colour it's not that big though mind you I could be wrong about that anyway this is a this is a must have I mean it, lovely seeing that come round on the turntable yeah I will get a liner and pop this in and an outer cover I think to protect it because I hate putting these in like this. I mean, even at £24, you'd think you'd have a a little plastic cover. So not a lot of money, are they, the little plastic ones that just keep the record from getting scratched. But I will do that. Don't worry, we'll look after it. That is nice, yeah. And I've, I've already done Man Machine and Techno Pop, and they both sound pretty good. Although I had some... Um, sort of strange sounds on one side for a while 
and after about two or three times of playing it, it seems to have died down. So it was nearly a miss pressing, and I think I just got away with it. It, it sort of took whatever it was off. The stylus might have just took it off, but uh, and I've seen on the comments a few people have had problems, but uh, fingers crossed that when when you do get one, the, the sound quality is pretty good. The bass is nice and punchy on these uh, recordings. So uh, I've only really had this on CD before, so it'd be nice have it on vinyl and I'm always a sucker for coloured vinyl so there we are. So that's the special edition yellow vinyl with booklet, craft work, computer world. Thanks for watching, see you again next time. <laughs>